in this video we will discuss fragment life cycle like activity fragment is also having life cycle so clearly in the developer.ini.com they are going to show you the fragment life cycle diagram so clearly from here itself we can get the knowledge so these are the methods we need to overwrite from the fragment class to check the fragment life cycle you will see on attach create on create view and till on attach method we need to use and how we check the uh, activity life cycle in the same way we can check the fragment life cycle let us do that one so uh, creating so already previously we have a project already we created that is a fragment creation so here we can go to the sample fragment class and uh, we need to overwrite the methods let us see here first of all first method is on attach method on create method so one by one we will overwrite it on attach method next on create method next on create view already we have overrated the on create view method next on activity created on activity created next method is on start and on resume methods so on start and on resume next on pause on stop on pause and on stop and the same way we need to override on destroy view on destroy on detach on destroy view and uh, on detach and on right on destroy on destroy like this we have overrated the methods simple we can keep the log statement how uh, and uh, how these methods are executing clearly we can check it out that's why i'm creating one tag string tag equal to fragment life cycle and now we are going to keep the log statements log dot d tag and this is the method on create view method next log dot d tag and this is the method on attach method in the same way here also log dot d tag and this is on create method and here log dot d and this one is tag and this one is on activity created method and here right fine we need to keep in the within double quotes log dot d tag on start method next log dot d tag on resume next log dot d tag on pause next log dot d tag on stop method next log dot d sorry tag on destroy view method next log dot t tag on detach method next log dot 
D. This is a tag. And on this toy method. So in this way, uh, we have overridden the methods. Now we can check it out clearly how this fragment life cycle is working. So we need to go to the DDMS and we are going to see that output in the locat. Right. Here we have a log. fragment creation now we'll see here on attach on create on create view on activity created on start on resume totally six methods executed and if you see also here on attach on create on create view on activity created on start on resume then only fragment is active here fragment is active and clearly we have observed this methods executed and how we uh, how we check the activity life cycle in the same way you can check the fragment life cycle if you hit the home button fragment goes to the background along with the activity then you will see which methods on pause method right see on pause method next on stop method two methods only again if you open the activity that comes from background to foreground along with that a uh, fragment is also coming to the foreground now we'll see on start on resume that's it two methods now if you hit the back button now which methods on pause next on stop on destroy view on destroy on detach as it is what they are showing on pause on stop on destroy view on destroy on detach method so like this you can check the uh, fragment live cycle thank you for watching